Hi, I am Arpita. Welcome to my channel. Today, I am going to share natural way to remove different kinds of stains from clothes. Stains need all the help they can get. Salt is the easiest and the best to remove the stains. I will answer some common questions you may have after the tips. Let's get into it right away. I have recently seen my friend's daughter fall and bruise her knee. Her new peach colored uh, cotton pant was stained with blood. Blood stains happen when it is least expected and salt comes handy. A fresh blood stain should disappear easily if it is immediately covered with salt and soaked in cold water. Keep adding fresh water and soak until stain is gone. If the stain is not handled immediately, also it is on a cotton, linen or other natural fibers, soak in cold salt water for one hour, wash using warm water and laundry soap, then keep the fabric in a large container of boiling water. Wash again. Gravy stains. Scrape out the excess gravy and cover a fresh stain with salt and let it absorb as much of the gravy as possible. Once this is done, rub the area with washing detergent or liquid dishwasher. Then wash the fabric in the hottest water allowed on the fabric care label. Grease stains. Remove a fresh grease spot on the fabric by covering it with salt. Wait for the salt to absorb the grease, then gently brush the salt away. Repeat until the spot is gone, then wash as usual. Fresh ink stains are easier to remove than dried ones. If you are lucky enough to spot an ink stain before it dries, cover the stain with salt, dab gently with a wet paper towel. Then brush off the salt, repeat until the stain is gone. Mildew Make a thin paste of lemon juice and salt, then spread the paste on mildew stains. Lay the clothing item out in the sun to bleach it, then rinse and dry. A mixture of salt, vinegar and water should remove mildew stains on most fabrics. Use up to a full strength vinegar if uh, mildew is more. Shower curtains are uh, one of the most common places to grow mildew. Prevent it by soaking them in a bucket full of uh, salt water. Half cup uh, salt in the tub. Soak the curtains for several hours then hang them to dry. Wine stains. Remove a wine stain from cotton fabric by immediately sprinkling stained area with enough salt to soak up the liquid. Then soak the fabric for one hour in cold water and wash as usual. Armpit stains. Those yellow stains in the armpit and around the collar of your favorite white shirts or tops aren't a sign that you are sweating too much or not cleaning properly. These areas are just harder to get clean. Undissolved deodorants may also be the reason. If you have a hard water, the deodorant residue, soap and perspiration can't wash off properly. Here is a method for removing uh, those sweat stains. Mix one quarter water with four tablespoons uh, salt. Sponge the mixture into uh, the stained area. Then repeat until the stain disappears. Wash as usual. As you have seen, salt can be an important part of laundry ingredients. Let me answer some of the common questions you may have. Number 1. Can you wash clothes in salt water? Yes, you can. Adding salt to your wash cycle helps remove stains and armpit discoloration and keeps uh, colors bright. Number 2. Can salt uh, remove stains from clothes? As explained so far, salt is an excellent household cleaner that you can use to remove different kinds of stains including wine, grease, blood, ink and mildew from your clothing. It's also great for getting the yellow stains out of the armpits of your shirts. Number 3. 
Can you use uh, white vinegar and salt together in laundry? Yes, vinegar and salt can be used together to remove stains, brighten colors and deodorize the washing load. Number 4. What does salt do in laundry starch? Adding salt to laundry starch can prevent your iron from sticking to clothing which will give your clothes a smoother finish. Did you ever use salt to remove any stains from your clothes? Type yes or no in the comments. If you have any more tips or questions, comment them below. I will choose one of your questions and answer through a short video for you. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, click the subscribe button and the bell next to it. I will see you all in the next video. Bye.